make the reef look colourful. Stream dried for a sec, by the way. What? It did? Oh dear. Oh dear. It was working fine yesterday and the other days. I... Twitch really needs to, needs to get... It sent a ping on Discord, that's how I know it wasn't me. Oh dear. Guess we're going to have two parts to this. Should be just fine if it's once, yeah. So far it's not giving me any warning about dropped frames or anything, so... I'm going to just assume everything is okay. <laughs> and that Twitch just had a random hiccup. Yeah. That must be it. Okay, what did I say about not putting my hand down on this? Go, there we go. It's a little extra shading to these mushrooms back here because we kind of need it. Also, some crystal shading, which is not very specific because I'm doing this from my head and nothing else. I wish it would stop itching around my neck. She's got a fiery orange hair. Why does it struggle to draw with orange? That's a bit weird. Like it's fine with the other colours, but this colour, it's apparently decided it's not going to work with me. Which is a bit mean. Oh, 
orange mermaid hair. I love her, the way she looks. Oh, we need to think of a colour for this merbit's fin that she's seeing here. Need to think of something for that. Hmm. 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 Ah. Oh. But that has time because first I want to finish Chanterelle. It's a bit of shading. Blue for nose and the mouth. The sides underneath her chin. Oh, and also her hands, which I'll just draw as these fist things because why not? Also, the other hand is just going to be there, <laughs> covered by hair. Because apparently I thought that hands do not deserve to be shown. They cause too much trouble, you know? Too much trouble, these hands. Open up. Ink pot. Of the scarlet variety. Shade her hate hair in a little bit. I think I might also add um, some more yellow in there, in those highlights. Again, just to highlight things. Give her a red nose and red cheeks. Ooh. And red top of her hand. <laughs> Ta -dam. I still have not gotten to open this. Doesn't seem like it will open anytime soon either. <sighs> I'll just leave it for now. Get a tiny brush. her face. You need to go to the gym. Nah, villagers need to be unstuck. I don't think going to the gym is going to open it up any faster. Why did you come to the gym? To defeat your enemies, perhaps? Nah, I just want to open an ink pot. Nah. I just have to remember to put it under hot water so that the lid just kind of softens enough for me to into it the ink pot is the enemy exactly it's my nemesis but i know a trick that's going to open it easily without having to use so much force that i don't have <laughs> i have tricks work smarter not harder i'm not going to subscribe to the gym just to open an ink pot that seems a bit silly <laughs> Especially since it would take time away from my art. <laughs> oh. 
okay, she looks very excited to see this uh, fish tail here. She's looking so excited. <laughs> so cute. So cute as well. Still don't know what colour I'm going to make his tail. Purple perhaps? Or red? Hmm. So many questions, so little answers. <sighs> colour choices are always so tough. So so tough especially for someone who's indecisive like uh, me yeah choosing color is not an easy thing for me sometimes unless it's this rock <laughs> some blue for I think her crown headpiece needs a little bit of shading just go with what your gut tells you to if only it were that easy <laughs> oh, let's don't get your hand in the ink that would not be good Let's go look let's go with purple let's go with purple purple is a nice color actually no 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 we're going to go with scarlet we're going to go with scarlet some shading shady shading fingers purple so far I don't see any blue on my hands though which is good I just vaguely coloring the empty spot in blue
<laughs> no, that doesn't look like great coverage yet. Da -da. Just a bunch of squiggly lines. Let's go the other way. And then dilute with water. So weird not to put my hand down on the paper when I'm doing this. But I don't want to get more ink on me than I physically need to. Da -da -da. Should have perhaps taken a brush, but I was feeling a little lazy, I guess. Or I wasn't feeling lazy because this is actually a lot more work than with a brush. So I wasn't feeling lazy. <laughs> this is looking very interesting. <laughs> we'll just get as much ink down as I can. Possibly put down with this. And then dilute with water. Thank you. The last step of all this uh, drawing is going to be adding a little more depth to that fishtail. Okay, perhaps it's not looking quite the way I would like it to. It's okay. It's okay, it's manageable. You can tell it's supposed to be blue background, so that's fine. <laughs> You just dilute the sand a little, get some colour everywhere. Oh, this is almost a completely filled page, which is, which is quite nice. Ooh. <laughs> the way the page looks on the other side. Oops, oopsies, oopsies. Uh, I need the apple green. There we go. Cool. I'll add a little more depth to this fish tail. And also some TTS2 bubbles and a little bit darker ink down here when it's still slightly wet. Okay, that seems fairly dry. Just allow it to spread out. Mm. 
I mean, it doesn't get rid of any of the lines, but it doesn't really have to. It just needs to get out of the depth in there. Ooh, let's have another sip of water. It's kind of cold. <clears throat> Oh dear. We'll just hope that it, when it dries, it's uh, not as bad. Right. Little bit of bubble detail. I don't want the stream to end. Once I'm done with these bubbles, there's nothing else to do, so um, yeah, that's pretty much all I can do today. I guess I will sign here. If you don't want the stream to end, you can always start again. <laughs> Nah, I like what we've come up with today, so I'll just keep it the way it is. I shall sign the painting, make sure this is dry, you <laughs> know, oops. Wait, what day is it? Did I remember to change my number in the title to seven? Seven. It's day seven, right? Yeah, day seven of her glow great okay awesome so tomorrow the prompt is going to be perennial. Can't wait to see what we're going to do tomorrow. Huh? Oh, let me just let it load. There we go. Perennial for tomorrow. Yee. Maybe we will meet this new person. Actually, perennial sounds like a cool name, you know. Sounds like a cool character name. Maybe that's what it is. We'll we'll see. Can't wait. Ooh. Really putting a lot of stuff on this on these pages. Pushing the sketchbook to its limits. Doing so many backgrounds as well. My name's Perennial, James Perennial. Perennial is such, it sounds very nice. I think that would be a nice surname or maybe even a first name. So far, none of these characters have surnames after all, so you know. Well then, I'll see you tomorrow for Perennial. Thank you for joining. I hope this Inktober day was quite nice. And I hope you have a lovely rest of the day as well. So, goodbye.
sky. I love the waves rock. Is it going to be another morning stream? I don't think so, because we're going to go on a trip tomorrow, and I don't know when we're going to be back, so I'm not sure about what time I'm going to stream tomorrow. I'm, sure, I'm certain though that I won't have wet hair. Unless it rains, have fun with your things. Thank you. I shall have a lot of fun for the rest of the day. I need to clean the bathroom, which I probably will do right after this. After tidying up and posting, I'll clean the bathrooms. And then this afternoon I've got some fun things to do. So, it should be an enjoyable Saturday. Yes. I hope you guys have an enjoyable Saturday as well. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Da -da -da -da, the mouse. Where's the mouse? Found the mouse. Goodbye. I'm also hoping for more cake. <laughs> Better cake, even. If mum saw that, you heard nothing. <sighs> There's birds outside. The big birds. I can't see any of the small birds anymore. Sad. Anyway, goodbye. Have a nice day.